Greetings, lords and ladies. This is Seth Hawkslot. I want to thank you for joining me as we play Super Mario Galaxy. In the last episode, we... Oh yeah, we did the we did the Gold Leaf Galaxy. And today, we're going to be doing the Sea Slide Galaxy. This one is kind of a fun galaxy because it involves a lot of water, but at the same time, it's kind of open. So, pretty cool galaxy. Okay, so the first uh, star is going after Guppy. Who is Guppy, you may ask? Is it this little, little fish? No, it's a giant shark. Yeah, it, that that looks that looks nice. I mean, at the same time, he's smiling. I, I guess he kind of looks nice. So, Sea Slide Galaxy going after Guppy. So, as you can see, all these penguins are all ready with diving and all that. But for right now, we're gonna just we're just gonna go see Guppy. Let's see what he wants. Is he gonna do something? Black. Yeah, you see, the story behind this is that the penguins, he's in the water, so he's keeping all the penguins out. We gotta free him. Now, who do we have here? You, you saw in front of those penguins? Let's get something clear here, Land Walker. This sea's mine. See, if you want it back, show some gills and make it through eight rings. So, we gotta make it through the rings that he's gonna create. So, he's all make it through each of these rings. Eh, come on, Mario, come. Wait, I don't think we have a shell, do we? Okay. Guys, I'd recommend grabbing a shell if you want to make this section a bit easier. So, okay, there we go. Now we have an advantage. So, we grab the shell. And thankfully, this section is actually pretty... It, the rings are really big, so it helps. If you don't know where the rings are going to spawn, it can be a little tricky, but besides that, it isn't just too bad. So, there's five. Five. Four, if we can ever find four. Okay. He's going down that route. That's fine. And then, in this cave, will he create one? Uh, okay. He's being... This cave's a little tricky to navigate. And then, okay, he created a three. Ching. And then, where will two be? Uh... Okay, two, and then one. Come on, at least one. Uh, okay, one, boom, got one. And look that Guppy just gave with the power star. He, he really had no alternative. And, and this is for evil. Nah, just kidding. He isn't that bad. He just wanted to. He just think around. Not bad for Land Walker. Well, I'm a fish of my word. The sea's all yours, buddy. He'll actually knock you back if you try to get near him. You don't want for doing that. <laughs> Mario. <laughs> okay, Mario's not gonna win that. <laughs> At least he doesn't damage us. And we got a power star. Awesome for the first star in the video. That was a really quick star, surprisingly. So, you see, now that we're getting later in the game, I think the star is like the comets aren't quite as appearing as much. So, which makes these things a little shorter. You gotta start going after Guppy Slee Slide Galaxy. <laughs> Slee Slide, huh? <laughs> you increased your star of count. Save your game. Saving, not turn the power off, reset the game. Game has been saved. Dang, I have gotta stop saying that. It's just like a habit right now. And a cosmic comet. There had to be a cosmic comet. I hate these comets. Well, no, okay, okay. They're kind of fun. Okay, I mean, every comet in this game is fun, but. Air level one, that's meh, but I guess this is kind of fun. I remember having a nightmare time with this race simply because, like, I would, I, I didn't know that really a Koopa shell made you faster and all. So, I was, I mean, I knew it made you faster, but I didn't really know how to control it or anything. I wasn't really great with the controls like, underwater ones at the most, so it was a really hard mission for me. Yes. So, walk forward a little bit, and you're gonna see that there's this evil guy again. Now, a tip, some tips for going really fast in the water. Uh, okay. So if you're gonna do that, uh, while you're swimming, before you get a shell, spin. And, and now you'll go much faster. Cosmic Mario will be right there ahead. And go through all of these speed rings. They will make you go a lot faster. For some reason, he's going on the surface, which is not the smartest decision. Now we can catch up, and we are in first place now. And there's some more of these rings right here. And then, uh, yes, you need to get out of the water. 
to go to this uh, section right here. And now it's race for the finish. It really is. Oh my gosh, we're so close. We're so close! Girl, yeah! I beat that Cosmic Mario. He tried so hard. He got really close, but I beat him first try. I bet he's wallowing right now. Whew. So that was the comics. The Cosmic. The Comet started this galaxy, or at least one of them. You gotta start underwater cosmic Mario race. See slide galaxy. Save your game. Save not turn the power off or reset the game. Your game has been saved. So now we can go to the second star and see slide galaxy, which is going to be I have no idea. Probably gonna be something special. I know there's like a star chip collecting one in this. Uh, okay, faster than a speeding penguin. Okay, is this a race one? Oh, yes! Guys, we are doing another race for this one. We're racing against a whole bunch of other penguins. And they think they're so special, but I'm gonna prove them wrong. I just raced against myself and I won. I think we are pretty good and deft to win. As you can see, these guys are just. There's like. Pfft, he's not gonna win. Although, I don't actually remember how you have to activate this race. You have to talk to this guy? Gippy? Uh, what do you got to say? Here's a little tip for you. If you pass through those underwater rings, you'll speed up. Do I have to talk to... to Seems like the whole game is finally going to straight up and swim right. Um, I, gotta, I just don't know where to like, go, actually. Who do I talk to? Do I talk to this guy? You got a penguin that's trying to hear. Want in? Sure. Alright, this race is on! Oh, come on, Mario. <clears throat> there we go. Now we can speed up on them. We're in fourth place now. We are speeding up hugely. Now we have got to get ahead of them. We are in third place now. We just passed by a uh, third guy. And we are getting really close in on those guys. They stand no chance. And oh my gosh, we are losing speed. Come on. These little tornadoes are kind of annoying, but thankfully they aren't too bad. So now we are in third place, but we are catching up. We are in second now. There are only that little penguin in, in the lead is ahead of us now. We still have plenty of race time to make up, you know, because we're awesome that way. Uh, okay. Gotta make it really... Oh, no. Okay. We are in first. We are first. Okay. Second. First. First. Okay. Go through these. Uh. Wait, where do we go? Oh, we gotta make it to the finish line. Uh, okay, speed through these. Oh, okay. We gotta make it to the finish line. We gotta make it to the finish line. So, we're coming. We're coming. Oh, oh. Oh, it's a close one. It's a close one. It's gonna be close, guys. Oh, oh. Yeah! Goal! Yeah! Beat those all, those little penguins. 124.61. Nice. Here's a gold medal, champ. Yup, there's the star. Although, I don't know why a star would be a gold medal. That doesn't make logical sense, but it's a Mario game. What do you expect? So, we're gonna do this the most awesome way possible. Back flipping into it. And yeah, Mario got the star like a pro. Now we only have one more star to get in this galaxy. Alright. So, there is one of our stars. And that, and that loom was just like... I like that. I like that wall. <laughs> Faster than speeding penguin, you can try to make counter hunger Luma has appeared. Engine room. Save your game. Save not turn the power off or reset the game. Save game has been saved. Now we're gonna go to the final star of Sea Slide Galaxy. I think this is a star chip collecting one. So this one may take a little bit longer, but I'm not quite sure. Wow, we have been doing these stars really fast. Okay, it's a silver star one. So the silver stars of Sea Slide. These stars are pretty annoying to get, if I'm being quite honest. Because you have to use an infamous power-up. The Bee Mushroom. There is actually a pretty funny glitch you can do in this level as well. It doesn't, like, destroy or anything either, which is cool. Okay, so what you I'm pretty sure what you need to do is you need to grab this Koopa Shell. Fire it at the bee mushroom, and then turn the camera. Or, no, I didn't hit it. 
Okay, okay, no, wait, never mind, sorry. You have to fire it at the bee mushroom, and then on the second bounce, uh, turn the camera. Then, flap into the water, and then up back. If you did it right, bee mushroom will not do anything. I did it wrong, probably, but that's okay. Well, you know what? <laughs> this glitch, it, it, it would have turned you into bee Mario underwater, which is kind of cool and all, since he's not like, meant to be underwater. But I guess it really doesn't have any purpose. So you can land on these clouds. And now you can go for after these uh, silver stars. Which I think this is one. Yeah, okay. So now follow these uh, star bits. Try to be very careful with your flight. Let's just hope that you don't land in the water. Which we successfully didn't. Because Mario's awesome that way. Now we got quite a distance to cover. Well, we can just land right there. But still could have kind of a distance. So you very... Uh, look at that. The penguin's just like, okay, I'll destroy your flight meter. No charge. So if you head over here, there's a little uh, Luma guy. I, and he'll do... I think he'll make like a different galaxy or something. So there is one of these uh, star shroom things right here. Uh, fly into this little thing right here. And then it'll send you up right there. Oh, no, no, wait, wait, wait. Okay, up here. Uh, you can see there's this silver star. I'd recommend getting really, like, attached to the area. And then, uh, staying there. There is a one-up mushroom right there. I'm not gonna use it at the moment, though. Simply because we don't wanna, like... You know, if we use that at the moment... Oh, well, I, I don't really know why that made that thing. I just didn't want to. Okay. So now we gotta make our way over here, since we have two of the silver stars. And as you can see, there already is another one right here. I am gonna try to make it to... Okay, I'll go with this one. This platform. Oh my... There's this. But at least there's another bee mushroom there. So now we gotta go after that. Because I know that this next silver star requires the bee mushroom. I uh, can go around this tower. And there is actually a treasure chest right here. Which you can uh, unlock with the Koopa shell right there. I'll check it. I'll do it real quick. This is one of those red ones. So, which isn't quite as common in the game, even though I, for some reason, can't pick it up. Maybe I can't pick it up as B Mario or something. Hey, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get damaged on purpose real quick. Okay, so you can't pick it up as B Mario, but that's okay. We, it only took a life thing off. So, vroom, and star bits. That, that was what it was worth, but I guess that's fine. So, now we got the B mushroom once again, and make your way over here, uh... Star, the silver star was like here. I'm pretty sure. So fly our way up here, and where? Was, okay, there it was. And I know you guys just saw the other silver star. It's over on that giant egg over there, or whatever it's called. Uh, I think to get there, you have to uh, maybe not do that, but kind of similarly. And then the last silver star is on this giant tree right here. Trust me, I've done this galaxy before. <laughs> So, there we go, recharge our flight meter, because we're going to need it to get onto this large branch type thing. There are some spiders up here, but luckily there is a bee mushroom as well. A little coin, I'm going to collect that real quick. Simply to, you know, because we don't want to be it circling it to life, that'd just be weird, you know? It'd just be like, uh, okay, oh, no, 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 I am secretly smiling right now. <sighs> anyway, ignoring that what just happened. Uh, you can make your way over here. You know, I, it's really weird is that I think they could have done more with this temple-like area. I feel like it could have been a more neat experience. And maybe that was... Okay, I forgot about that. So that'll teleport you over to the egg over there. So I guess that little star won't. And if you make your way over here, you'll be on the bottom side of this neat little egg thing. And as you can see, it is shaped like an egg. I don't know if I said that, but it is. So there's this giant coin right here, it'll create these music notes, which I don't think lead to anything really special or anything, but maybe it'll lead like a one-up or something. So, leading there, uh, continue flying, you can listen to the tunes, and what did that do? Okay, it gave me a one-up mushroom. And if you reach the top, there's that elderly penguin guy, uh, his name is, there's all kinds of hubbub in Sea Slide, what's going on? Oh, maybe that wasn't his name. So now that we collected that silver star, you can go into this huge launch star area. You can blast directly to this area. 
Although it does kind of stink that we don't have the bee mushroom or anything. Although I wonder if you can go in these clouds. With... Okay, I guess you can. That's cool. Or, or not. I'll make my way over Mario. Come on. Okay, let's grab that shot real quick. A tree. Okay, I think that tree is trying to, it's like trying to be mean right now. But thankfully, it pushes on the surface. I guess it did a good deed at the same time. So there's that branch that was recently above us, or like right there. And Mario's spinning controls are so weird underwater. Like I see people do it really fast, and then I'm just like, what? And then I, when I try to do it, it just fails miserably. So now we have to get over to this uh, bee mushroom right here. I'm not gonna try to do the glitch or anything. Uh, come on, Mario, and boom. Okay, got it, got it. Now with that. You can make your way over here. Come on, come on, almost, almost there, almost there. It's nice. Anyway, now we can try to make it to the top of this tree again, which hopefully it will not make me fall off this time, because no one wants that. Uh, make to this huge branch. This is a huge tree, by the way. Whoever planted this tree, they did an accomplishment, just saying. So now you can make it to these other branches. They eventually branch up and up and up and up. And is that the... Okay, that's not That's not the silver star. That's just the enemy. But the silver, actual silver star is up here. Not yet, but almost there. At the very top of this tree. And we collect it. And boom, we got them. So now they're going to form into the power star. Which is awesome. And it appears halfway... Well, at least we got it. At least I'm at least I'm gonna be thankful that we got it. So I would not recommend falling off right here, because these silver stars are pretty annoying to get. I mean they're cool, they're fun at the same time, but in all honesty, they can be kind of annoying to get. So boom, we got the power star. That was awesome. That was a sweet little one of those long hua hua missions, like just the breathers. And now we can do the final star, at least that I know of this galaxy, is the secret star. The silver star sees that galaxy. Oh, yeah, we can just go through all this. So you guys enjoy this galaxy. It's one of the, it's the only, I, I personally think the only cool part is that it's like, there's a lot of shells in it, plus it introduces red shell, which, I mean, it, it, I mean, obviously, it's been introduced in the past. I mean, the first Super Mario Bros. game, but, and I don't know, it, it, it hasn't, it didn't really get a big role in this, uh, Game, so it's just kind of cool to see it there. So do you remember that hungry Luma that we saw on the previous area? Well, we're gonna have to go back and get his help. So collect all these star bits. I'm pretty sure he takes uh, star bits. If he doesn't, then we are gonna be stuck in a pickle. So as you can see, it's over. Okay, where is this? You know, I'm, I'm gonna assume it's over here. I think it's over here. So Remember, it's that little area that's kind of like a little off and stuff. So there are some uh, star bits around here. Uh, luck luckily, we've already gotten 13, and... Okay, that was kind of weird. That was like an invisible wall. I don't quite remember if the Luma does actually record... Oh, that was so hardcore. Mario looked amazing when doing that. It was just like a backflip type thing. That looked awesome. So now we're on the main island, and there he is. Let me collect all these real quick. I wonder how many star bits he actually does require. That'll, unless it's coins. That, that'd be annoying if it was coins, because I don't think there are a lot of coins in this galaxy. So, okay, yes, he's holding a uh, star bit ones. If you made a bunch of star bits, burst with snacky happiness, I need four of you. Oh, wow, you're hungry. Okay, you're hungry. So now we need to collect a whole bunch more, which thankfully isn't really bad. They're just kind of scattered everywhere. And there we go. We just collected the rest. And cannons are so much fun. Whee! Well, you're right about that. So, thankfully, we can miss one if we want to. Or are we just going to feed him whole? We're not going to miss anything. And he's steaming. That's it. I'm stuffed. Here we go. I don't remember being full, like, when you steam. Like, I got to do, like, if you did exercise or something, and you were just like, hoo, 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 hoo. that could kind of get you a little tired and stuff, but. It's the... So now you use this cannon, and it'll. And you can blast off to, the, to this galaxy. Do you guys remember this galaxy? This is the Hurry Scurry Galaxy. But now we are doing it as just a normal, like, level. It's not a galaxy anymore. It's just the normal area. So, it's just like it, it, it 
functions exactly like the last one. Maybe it's more difficult or something. I don't know. It seems that the music notes are on every single block or something. Because it, it doesn't seem to be any different. Really. So, I'm hearing slow music in the background. So maybe this is timed or something. It doesn't seem like it. But maybe it is. So now, uh, activated that. Uh, long jump over here. Uh, zoom, zoom, zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom. See, in this one, the goal is a little different. You have to collect all of the music notes. And the other one, I think, like, half the platforms or something were music notes, and then the other half weren't. Which, it, it's, it's kind of neat to see that they wanted to do every little platform in this one. So, now collecting them all. And, this is cool and all. Uh, ooh, try not to miss or anything. I don't actually know if this section is timed. I think it is, but... Thankfully, it isn't really bad or anything if it is. And now, we are on the we are on the final platform. I'm gonna do a long jump. Oh, this is awesome. This is one of the hugest long jumps in history. Just look at how awesome we look right now. We're just zooming by this planet. Whoa. Uh. Okay, we had to eventually go into the star, I guess. But that was fun while it lasted. So you got a star. And that, guys, is the beach galaxy I think that's what it was called or the, no wait it was the sea slide galaxy I'm thinking of something else you increase your star bit count save your okay yeah I was thinking of the third world beginning star save not to the power of the game has been saved and that was pretty sweet we got the hidden star I don't know there's always a hidden star in each of these three star like galaxies so I'm gonna end the video here guys thank you for watching please give a like and be sure to subscribe this galaxy, it's not the most coolest, but I, I I know I mentioned this thing like I'm bad talking it, but honestly, all the galaxies in this game are amazing. Not a single one is bad, so I really do like this game, and I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe, and fare thee well. See you guys next time.